everybody! Vicky here from Comma Baby South Tyneside. Happy Good Friday! Um, I hope you're all ready for some family yoga. So we're going to have some family yoga this morning and um, we're going to be doing some Easter style poses uh, where all the family can join in. So we're going to have the babies, the toddlers um, and the juniors and the mums and dads. Everybody can have a little go. Um, so what we'll need to do is just support some of our little ones who need support. So some of our babies, just like my baby behind me here. Our Carlos, he will need support and so I may have to hold him in some of the poses. Um, he might have to have a little break in some of the poses. Um, but then our older children will be able to do this completely under, uh, independently. Hi, hi Evelyn. <laughs> Hi everybody, I can see everybody popping on so I'm just going to wait and just say hi and we'll just start a few minutes later say oh William and Sophia here, hello, happy Easter, happy Easter to you too oh it's so lovely to see everybody, keep popping up and saying hi so I know you're there okay then, that's lovely, oh so lovely to have everybody and I think the sun's coming out so I think if we just do our yoga really well this morning the sun's going to shine and we can get in the gardens so that would be lovely wouldn't it it was a bit dreary this morning when I first started uh, setting up my little uh, Easter things. So now it's starting to be lovely. So I think it's going to be nice and sunny and nice spring morning for us. Happy Easter. Hi. Hi, everybody. Harry, hi. <laughs> oh, I miss you, Theo, too. Hi. Oh, so lush to see everybody. Oh, thank you for supporting this morning. So we've got a lovely weekend of Easter. We're going to have me with our family yoga first of all. And then we're going to move on. We've got our fabulous baby yoga from Emma after me at 11. And then she's doing preschool yoga for your little ones, two to four, two to five age. And then we've got a lovely relaxing baby massage later as well with our Rachel. And then tomorrow it continues. More Easter yoga. Saturday, full theme of yoga tomorrow as well. Baby, toddler, all the way up to teens and some mindfulness as well. So that's amazing. Hi, hi everybody. Hi Lisa, hi. Hi Karen, <laughs> hi Laura, oh so lovely to see everybody. Okay then, we're going to get started then, okay, because I could just say hi to everybody, I miss you all so much, I'm just going to be saying hi to everyone all morning, but when you get started, when you get cracking, so I hope you've got your Easter bunny ears on like me and Carlos, I hope you have, I hope you're all dressed up ready. Okay then, Carlos is going to just pop there for a second, so we're going to ring our bells, so are we ready to listen for our magical three bells? So we're going to listen, we're going to sit up tall, we're going to take a nice deep breath, <sighs> get nice and calm, get nice and centred, and let's ring our bells. Wow, fantastic, you all sound so amazing, well done. Hi Ava, <laughs> hi, hi Abby, hi Emily, hi. <laughs> oh, Becky's here too, lovely, hi. Okay, then we are gonna start then. So we're gonna start with Mr. Sun. So we're gonna sit in a cross leg position with our backs nice and tall, sitting up lovely and tall. Hi to Halle, hi Zach. <laughs> we're gonna do our Mr. Sun. So are we ready to stretch our arms up nice and tall? Let's have a big stretch up, let's sing. Big stretch up, we're gonna do Mr. Sun and then when we stretch down, we're gonna try and bring our legs forward and see if we can tickle our toes down there. So are we ready? I'll sing nice and loud. I hope you're singing along at home as well. I can almost hear you if you sing really loud. And if we sing really loud and do our really big stretches, Mr. Sun will shine. I can see my garden lighting up right now. It must be all these lovely comments coming through. That must be what it is. Hi, William. <laughs> oh, I can see you all coming on. Hi, Kitty, hi. Are we ready then? Let's have a go. Let's see. One, two, three. Coming in for Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun. Ready to stretch? Please shine down on me. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun. Let's hide. Hiding behind a tree. Boom. These little yogis are asking you. To please come out so they can play with you. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun. Please shine down on me and tickle those toes. Oh, very good. Little stretch to start the day. Hello, hello. 
Phoebe and Zach, hi, I miss you as well. Hello. Okay, we're going to stretch our bodies to get ready. So we're in our cross leg position already. We're going to have a little stretch and make ourselves really tall. So we're going to really stretch up. So can we stretch all the way up? Who can stretch as high as me? Who can stretch even taller? Can you touch? I'm nearly touching the bunnies at the top. I'm going to check where they are. There's all the bunnies. Have a little stretch. And can we put one hand down and can we stretch all the way over? And can you give me a little wave on this side? Hi. And can we put the other hand down and stretch all the way over again? And on this side, give me a wave. Oh, you're doing so good waving. Hi, Emma. We're going to do it again. We're going to come all the way over. Stretch over. Big stretch in your side, buddy. And have a little stretch. You can probably stretch all the way. I just don't want to miss out the camera. So I'm going a little bit less stretchy, but you stretch all the way over. Big stretch. And bring yourself back. Lovely big stretching, everybody. That was amazing. Hi, Eli. <laughs> oh, hi, Tobias. Hi, Lucas. Okay, then we are going to get ready and do some things. So we're going to think about the garden. So in our garden, it's springtime. And we find lots of things in there and we have been planting i don't know if you've been planting but we have been planting seeds in our garden so we're going to come straight into a little seed pose and we're going to try and remember all these poses because there might be a little quiz at the end oh my goodness there's always something so it might be something like that at the end so make sure you remember in the poses that i'm talking about so we're going into seed pose first of all so can you come onto your knees like me can you scrunch down as low as you can Hi girls, coming down, coming down and hide your body, hide your body and tuck your head in and let me see your seed pose. I'm going to come up and check and see if you're doing it right. Oh yes, I can see. Well done, lovely. That is amazing seed poses. So stay down there because I'm going to put some water on you. So get down in your seed pose and we're going to make you grow. So we're going to pour the water on you and the sun's coming out. So we need water and sunshine to grow our spring plants so we're going to start growing so can you please shoot up one arm and get one seed coming up one shoots coming up and the other seeds coming up and then put your hands down and can you grow a little taller come on to your toes now come on to your toes okay and then can we grow a little bit taller can you put your hands together and grow a little bit taller balancing on those toes can we balance and can we grow even taller oh my goodness we're all the way up we're so tall and that's like the plants in our garden in springtime and there's a really big plant if a plant grows so tall sometimes it turns into a tree so can we see if we can do tree poles right now see if you can do it with your grown-ups if you've got a little one you might need to hold your little one in this pose so we're going to bring a foot to our ankle and we're going to get our branches out so we might put our branches all the way out to the side we might put our branches all the way up to the sky, or we might wrap our branches around us to make it a bit more tricky. <gasps> Those are fantastic trees. Can we hold it for 10 more seconds? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Take it down. <gasps> that was so amazing. Well done, everybody. If that was really easy, you can bring your foot a little bit higher up your leg if you found that really easy peasy. Shall we try it again? on this side now we can't leave this side out we can't we need to do this side too so let's take that foot over to the other leg let's take it on and bring your hands together and then start growing your branches out oh tree pose very good let's see if we can hold it for 10 9 8 7 6 5 keep going 4 3 2 1 take that foot down that was an amazing tree oh, thinking of trees if we're in the garden what could fly down and land on our branches? What do we think? Can anybody shout it out? Oh, what do you think? We've got the tree and something flies down and then lands on it. Oh, yes, you are right. It is a bird. What can I do a bird pose? So we've done, we've done uh, seed pose. We grew our seed into a plant. We've done our tree pose. And now this is bird pose because you've got to remember these poses, remember. So get your flappy wings out. Can you stand on one leg? Can you push that leg behind? And can you fly your wings forward like a bird flying? Oh, amazing, yes, fantastic, fantastic. Lovely, lovely, lovely. And bring them down. Okay, let's try it again on the other side. Bring that leg up, stand on that leg, come on. Oh yes, I can see you doing it, you're doing amazing. Get those arms out, get those wings out, flap those wings a little to get ready. We're gonna shoot off, we're gonna jump off that tree branch 
and let's go forward bring that leg back oh very good everybody excellent bird poses they were amazing oh my goodness okay we're coming back to the floor everybody so we found some plants in the garden we found a tree we found some birds but what about the beautiful colored things that pop out through the grass they're not pl they are plants but they are very different what do you think what do you think? Flowers, yes. Oh, I knew you would know that answer. Flowers, okay, let's try a flower pose. So now we need to bring our feet together and this makes our knees pop out to the side. And it doesn't matter where your knees are going. They might be up here, they might be down there, they might be all the way down the bottom. It doesn't matter. It's only a bit of fun. So grown-ups, don't worry if they're all the way up here, that's fine, okay? So we're gonna try our butterfly, um, not butterfly, that's coming later, shh. Flower pose. So we're gonna take our feet and we're gonna bring them all the way up. And we're gonna see if we can bring our feet up to here. And we're gonna see if we can do a flower pose. Do you think we can? Oh my goodness, wow, flower pose, yes. And can you hold it there and do a little balance and balancing on your bottom? Make sure your grown-ups are doing this too. And if you've got a little baby, they may have to sit on your in between your legs and they may have to hold them in this position, making it even more difficult for our grown-ups. But you can do it. You are multitaskers. Fantastic flower pose, excellent. Okay, and I gave a little clue before, but what flies around flowers? Not buzzy bees, because they do very important jobs, but something else with beautiful wings and beautiful colors sometimes. What do you think? Ooh, they grow from caterpillars. If the hungry caterpillar eats all the food, he turns into a, <gasps> you got it, butterfly, butterfly, well done everyone. Oh yes, Jessica got that right, amazing. Okay, let's see your butterfly pose and bring them feet together. Bring these knees apart, see where they land. They might be up here, they might be down there, they might be all the way down there. We're gonna flap them, we're gonna flap those wings and we're gonna fly like a butterfly. So we've got a little song for this one. So we're gonna do a little gentle little rock, holding our feet and we're going to fly like a butterfly. Well done, Emma, lovely putting that on, beautiful. Let <laughs> Mark, you're doing such a good job, well done. Let's sing, fly like a butterfly, fly like a butterfly, fly like a butterfly in the sky. Fly like a butterfly, fly like a butterfly, fly like a butterfly, up so high. We're gonna stretch, we're gonna try that flower pose again. We're gonna stretch our butterfly wings. We're gonna bring them up, we're gonna sing. Stretch like a butterfly, stretch like a butterfly, stretch like a butterfly in the sky. Stretch like a butterfly, stretch like a butterfly, stretch like a butterfly up so high. These butterflies are getting tired. We're going to sleep, so we're going to take our head down, see if we can smell our feet. Do our feet smell the day? Doesn't matter if it does. We're going to take them down. Are we ready? Let's go all the way down. Let us sleep like a butterfly, sleep like a butterfly, sleep like a butterfly in the sky. Sleep like a butterfly, sleep like a butterfly, sleep like a butterfly up so high. <gasps> Give your feet a big clap and that was amazing. Well done, fantastic butterflies and flower poses. Remember them poses. Okay, we're gonna change into something else now. So we find animals in Easter. Lovely spring, beautiful animals are born around Easter time. Lots and lots of them. Lots of animals have babies at this time. So we're going to think about some animals that we might find. So, some animals, there was a song about one. Mary had one um, and also she lost it somewhere. I don't know if you might know who this one is. Um, and they have white, normally white, sometimes black curly fur. And their mummies are called sheep or ewes yes you've got it lambs well done fantastic A little lamb symbol popped up there that was amazing okay so get on the knees let me see your lambs we're going to do a big sound i hope you've got your voices ready i hope you've had your weir bigs and i hope you're ready you've got your voice your vocal cords all ready so we're going to take our hands down and we're going to, yes well done eva i knew you'd know that one okay so let's see your lambs so i want you to look at your Oh, your tummies should be full of breakfast right now. So let's look at those tummies. Watch out for your ears, my pop off just like mine. Oh, and then when we look forward, I want you to do your big ba, just like a lamb. Do you think you can do it? Yes, oh, Laura, well done. 
Let's come down and look at your belly. Your belly should be full of breakfast by now. Look them through. And let's hear you. Ma oh, they were lovely lambs. Can you do it one more time, but really loud? And see, wake up everyone in the house in case anyone's having a lion. If they're so lucky to have a lion, let me see you bring those through. Let's go down. And one, two, three. Ba. <laughs> Oh, well done, Elizabeth. Are the girls doing it? Oh, that's amazing. Okay, lovely. Let me see. That was our lamb post. So we have lambs. Oh, oh, what comes out of the eggs sometimes? Oh, there's some behind me on my pictures, you might say. Mm, they are yellow and fluffy. I'm going to come up onto our toes. And we're going to take our knees out. And we look a little bit like a chick, a chick. That's right, a chick. Chick, 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 chick. So we're going to do a little song. So we're going to pretend, we're going to balance on down here. And when we take our fingers away, we're going to flap, okay? So we're going to flap like a chick. Oh, are you ready? So we flew like a butterfly, we're going to flap like a chick. So we're going to take our hands up. We're going to balance on our toes, our knees are out at the side. So if you can do this with a grown-up, you might have to hold hands and flap your hands together and make your wings if you need to. If you've got a little one, they might need to be held on this one or popping down and giving them lots of eye contact as they're down there, okay? Everyone get involved. So let me see your chicks. Chick pose. Let's take those hands up. Let's make those flappy wings. And we're going to sing. Flap, flap, went the little Easter chick one day. Flap, flap, went the little Easter chick. Flap, flap, went the little Easter chick one day. And they all go flap, flap, flap. <gasps> but we know chicks go. Tra la 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 la. Tra la 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 la. Tra la 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 la, we know chicks go. Tra la 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 la, they don't go. Flap, flap, flap. <gasps> Did you stay balanced for that whole song? Are you still balanced right now? Let me see. Oh, <gasps> you're still doing it. You're so balanced. You are such a fantastic yogi. Well done, everybody. Okay, bring your knees down. And let's do one more. So we're going to become the Easter bunny because he's so important in Easter. And I'm hoping that he's going to come today. Oh, the sun's out now. You see how well you're doing? The sun is shining because you are doing so well. I'm so proud of you all. So let me see. Let us stand up and be Easter bunnies. So we're going to stand up tall. And we are going to become an Easter bunny. For the bunnies, like to stick out their bottoms like that. So we're going to do our, chair, um, our bunny pose by bringing our knees down and sticking our bottoms out. Because we have a little um, fluffy tail on the end, you see. And we're going to take our hands up like this. So this is our Easter Bunny pose. So are you ready to do Easter Bunny? So we are going to be not just the Easter Bunny, we are going to be the grand old Easter Bunny right now. So we're going to hold our hands up like this and we're going to sing the grand old Easter Bunny. He had 10,000 eggs. He rolled them up to the top of the hill and he rolled them down again. And when they were up, they were up, up here. And when they were down, they were down. And when they were only halfway up, they were neither up or down and bend your knees. So you're going to feel it on your legs. You're going to work really hard in this one. So let's have a little break. Wiggle them legs. Get ready. Have a nice deep breath. And let's see you pop down into your bunny position. Bend those knees. Take them bottoms out. Give them a little wiggle. Okay. Are we ready? Oh, the grand old Easter bunny. He had 10,000 eggs. He rolled them up to the top of the hill. And he rolled them down again. And when they were up, they were up, up. And when they were down, they were down, down, down. And when they were only halfway up, they were neither up or down. Give yourself a big clap. Well done. Oh, lovely. You're doing it on your own, Leon. I love it. Okay. Oh, yes. I could see our Samuel's on as well. Okay, bring your legs back down. Should feel that in your legs now. Ooh, had a little bit of a workout there. Okay, so we know about the Easter bunny. We've done our lamb pose, our chick pose, our bunny pose. Hmm, what does the Easter bunny bring though? What do I think? What's he hoping that he's going to bring today? What do you think? Did anybody shout out? Oh, what do you think? What was that? Chocolate eggs. Oh my goodness, yes, that's what he brings. I'm hoping, I'm hoping he brings them to me. I have been a good girl. Okay, so chocolate eggs. So we're going to make some chocolate eggs. Do you think we can make some chocolate eggs? Do you think we can? I don't know. Eggs! <laughs> I heard you! 
it. I heard you, Ava. Okay, let's see if we can do it. So we're going to try and make the chocolate egg. So we need all the ingredients, first of all. So can you cross your legs? Get your back nice and straight because we've got to find all the ingredients and they're on all these different shelves. So we're going to find them. So we're going to take our hands to the back. Oh, and there's the first ingredient. Put it down. And then the next one. Go up. There's another one. Oh, and there's one right up here. Can you get it right at the top? Oh, bring it down. It's a heavy one. Oh, there's one right on that top shelf. Can we stretch up? Oh, and bring it all the way down. That was a big one. And then there's one on that one. Oh, oh, fantastic. We've got all the ingredients. All of us loving it. Yay. Okay, fantastic. Are we ready then? Let's get going. Let's get moving. So we are going to start making the eggs. We've got all the ingredients. We need to mix it. We need to mix it. So we're going to take out our mixing parts. So we're going to take this mixing and we're going to take an opposite leg. So we're going to mix everything together, mixing it all up, doing our diagonal stretching. And this is really good for our brains. It's going to give us a brain boost as well as being stretchy. We're going to have amazing brains too. So let me stretch. Oh, and let me stir and mix to the mixture. And the other side, bring up that other leg and get this other stirring spoon and mix it, mix it, mix it, mix it, mix it. Oh, that is amazing. Well done. Fantastic. Lovely. I think the mixture is almost ready. Pop them down. Okay. But to make the magical Easter eggs that the Easter money brings, we've got to have the magic word. So the magic word, I'll tell you, secret, is Easter Kadabra. Okay. Easter Kadabra. But we've got to say it nice and loud. So are you ready to shout? Easter Kadabra after three. Are you ready? Okay. One, two, three. Easter Kadabra! <gasps> I couldn't hear you. Can you say that again? A little bit louder. Are you ready? Let's try again. <gasps> One, two, three. Easter Kadabra! <gasps> the mixture still hasn't got the magical powers in it. Let's try one more. Are you ready? One, two, three. Easter Kadabra! <gasps> the magical mixture is ready. <gasps> it looks fantastic. It looks absolutely ready. So we need to make it into the egg shapes. So we're going to have to make an egg shape with our bodies, okay? Yes! Easter Kadabra! Well done! <laughs> oh, Lisa and Mark, your house must be buzzing this morning. Okay, <laughs> so let's make our egg shapes. So we're going to make our egg shapes now. So we're going to take our arms and make a lovely big egg shape up here like this. Okay, can you do this? But then we need to make it round. So we're going to round it forward. So we're going to put our heads down and bring our head, hand, hands to the front. And then we need to make the back bit as well. So we're going to take our hands behind and stretch our arms out at the back to make the back bit. <gasps> can we do that one more time? Hi, Samuel. <laughs> let's do that again then so we've got to make lots of eggs so every time we do it we probably make about 100 eggs so that's really good so let's do it again bring it up and forward to make the front head down stretch and then take your hands behind and make the back bit oh okay oh, I think we made about a thousand now let's try two more shall we try two more Easter Bunny needs so many coming up looking up check and looking down, check at the front and check the back. <gasps> wow, you made so many eggs. They were amazing eggs. Well done, everybody. So, the Easter Bunny is nearly ready to deliver them, but we need to put them in the basket. So then, our little yogis and our big yogis, I hope you're joining in, and you can always bring in, and we'll bring Carlos in for this one. So we're gonna bring in our little yogis. You might have a little yogi who wants to sit on your knee, you might have a baby that needs a lot of support. You're going to take your hand across the chest and just hold on the bum and just make sure they're fully supported. Our little um, preschoolers, our juniors, even our bigger yogis who want to have a little cuddle and have a sit on, I want to make you work harder. Okay, so if you want your grown-ups to work harder, jump on their knees right now and we're going to do our basket pose. So what we're going to do, we're going to take our one arm out, one arm out, and then one leg up and then one leg up and then take your hands to the front and this makes our basket and our hands make our little basket handle to hold on and then our eggs can go in the middle so we're going to try that again but we're going to try it for some 10 seconds shall we try if we can do it do you think we can okay 
are you ready so let's take out one arm two arms one leg two legs handle at the front and hold it there oh can we do it for ten nine oh i count very slowly eight must have to that before that seven then six hmm, five four what's next three two one very good basket pose that was our basket pose amazing okay so now we are ready we're going to deliver some of these eggs so let's get these eggs delivered so we're going to just start throwing them around to deliver them all around the world that they need to go to so we're going to put one behind me back Ooh, one went that way and then one went that way and you put one in the front one in that way one there one there go faster go faster how many can you do how many can you do oh my goodness we need to keep throwing them throwing them throwing them throwing them faster 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 phew stop okay i think these bunnies deserve a little break a little rest and they might want a little sleep so shall we do sleepy bunnies shall we lie down let's all lie down and let's do our sleepy bunnies are you ready so let's scrunch on down back down and have a little light we can go back into our seed pose or we can just have a little lie down on the floor. So I'm going to watch you all have a little lie down. Make sure everyone's down. Make sure everyone's bunny tails are popping up. But everything else is lying down. So are we ready? Let's listen for our song. So let's lie down, everybody. Before we go, we're going to do our test, okay? So we're going to do musical yoga statues. So I'm going to put a little bit of music on. And then when I stop the music, I'm going to say the poses that we've learned this morning. And I want you to show me them, okay? Are you ready? Oh, Hannah and Florence, hi, was that your favourite? I know, I miss you too. Are you ready then? Shall we have a little go? So let's see, you've made me so happy. I think we need some happy music on. So when you hear the music, I want you to see you dancing. Show me your best dance moves, the best dance moves ever. Are you ready? <gasps> I'm ready for your dance moves. Let me see them. Oh yes, let's see the dance moves. Come on everybody, keep dancing, keep it going. Keep wiggling those bunny tails. <sighs> okay, are you listening? Oh, butterfly pose. Can you remember butterfly pose? What do we do? The butterfly, bottoms to the floor and our feet together. Yes, that was it. Fantastic and well done. Okay, back to dancing. I'll stay in butterfly pose. Okay, can you remember seed pose? Oh, can we remember seed pose? Can you remember? Can we remember seed paws? What do we do? We scrunch down in seed paws. We hide away. You've got it. Well done. Back up again. Let's have a dance. Because I'm happy. Oh, fantastic. Okay, what from the seed? What grew up? What was the tallest thing that grew? It was very tall. It had big branches. And we put our branches up high. Can you remember? Yes, it was the tree paws. Show me the tree paws. Best tree pose ever. Are you ready? Let's do it again. Oh, on the tree, something landed. It flew down, had a beak and wings, and it was our 
bird pose, yes, bird pose. Can you remember when we stood up and we put one leg up and we flew our wings forward and our leg came back? It was our bird pose, yay, bird pose, amazing. <laughs> Have another dance, keep going, you're doing brilliant. I'm remembering so much. We've only done nearly half an hour, how good is that? We can walk for the morning, it's going to be a great Friday. Okay, who can remember the chick pose? Oh, it's a tricky one. Didn't do this for very long, so I'll help you out. Remember when we balanced on our toes? We did the flap flap song. Flap flap went the little Easter jig. One day, flap flap went the little Easter jig. <gasps> That's it, well done everybody. Okay, couple more, couple more. Keep it going, can you do it, can you do it? Let's keep going. Doing amazing. Let's hit C. <gasps> How many more have we got? Oh. What about the animal that went bah? Can you show me your lamb pose? Oh, what do we do? We looked at our hungry tummies, our full tummies, and then we came forward for a bah. Yes, that was it, well done. Okay, two more. Do you think we could do two more? Oh, I think we might be done. Are we done? Oh, well, okay, we're done for now then. Well done, that was amazing, that was so good. You did so many amazing poses. I'm so proud of you all. Okay, so right now, what we're gonna do, we're gonna just pop on a little bit of, um, it's quiet because we're gonna have a little bit of a breath <sighs> and a little bit of a cuddle. And I'm gonna get my bubbles out and my bubbles are gonna be around the screen. And while you're watching the bubbles, I want you to see if you can count how many Easter chicks have hatched from all them Easter eggs that we threw around. They've turned into chicks and they're all behind me. And I want you to count how many and I want you to pop on the comments if you can count how many there is. So while you're ready, I'm going to put the bubbles on and you're going to see if you can count. Okay, so let me see if you can do it. Are you ready? Are you steady? Okay, I'm going to turn away. You're going to try and look for them. See if you can see them. Can you see any? There's some bubbles coming in, but can you see any chicks? Can you see any chicks over there? Oh, how many do you think? I'm just going to give you a few seconds to count them and just have some nice deep breaths as you're relaxing. Oh, keep counting, keep counting. How many can you find? How many can you find? Have you found any? Oh, keep looking. Oh, last few seconds. Have you found them? Have you found them? Okay, I'm gonna go with through with them. Oh, let me see how many, has anyone put any comments in? Oh, let's see, oh. There's lots of bunnies, but I didn't see bunnies, I just had chicks, didn't I? So we've got our bunnies up there. So I'm gonna help you count them and see if, if, see if you were right. Okay, so down here, we've got a big mama chick, one, and then another baby chick, two, and another mama chick, three, four, five, six, seven, oh, has anyone got seven? Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Who got twelve? Who got twelve? Who was right? Were you right? Oh, did you get 12? Oh, I can see some people did get the right answer. Oh, well done, really good try, and that was amazing. So the big shell is not a chick, but it was, it was where chick's from, so you might have put that one. Yes. <laughs> oh, see, and then we've got our rabbit and our lamb and our rabbit, no. And Carlos isn't a chick. And we've got bunny ears on, so we can't be a chick today. But well done, everybody, that was a brilliant, yes. Oh, no, we're not cut off, oh, uh, plastic ducks, I know, the sign. 13, if you count the sign, well, I'll give you the point. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt because it is, it is a chick on the sign, you're right. So 12 or 13, if you count the sign, I'll give it to you. I'll give it to you today, I'm being kind. Okay, I hope you've enjoyed the day, everybody. And um, we've just got one more thing to do. We're gonna do our bells again, and then I'm gonna let you go. And stay tuned because Emma's coming up soon for your baby. <laughs> Is it a trick? I thought they were ducks. <laughs> yes, tuck, 
tricks have been up to say thing. Oh, you know what I mean, man. If you know me, you know what I mean. Okay. Are you ready then? <laughs> you got it right. Well done. Okay, then let's ring the bells. Okay, very good. Happy Easter, everybody. Have a fabulous Good Friday and the rest of the Easter weekend. Please stay with us. Um, Emma's up at 11 with the baby yoga and then preschool yoga after lunch and then baby massage today. And then tomorrow we've got more baby yoga, more toddler yoga. We've got our teen yoga, our junior yoga um, and some mindfulness as well to keep everyone chilled over the Easter weekend. Please stay home. There's, um, the sun's out, we can get in the garden and please just stay safe everybody, we really miss everybody but we need to stay safe and stay home. And if you enjoyed family yoga, we have some family yoga sessions on our South Tyneside um, page. So please visit the website and all the classes are on there. Our branch is South Tyneside if you've enjoyed ours but there's um, lots of classes to choose from. And we have lots of classes available to book. So hope to see you again soon, thank you so much for tuning in. And so much thank you for all your comments and your likes and everyone saying hi, it really meant a lot. I thought I might have been talking to myself, so I'm glad you were all there to talk about the day. If you want to do a little replay and watch this later, it's going to stay on the Facebook page um, so you can watch it live, uh, not live, you can watch it as a replay later on, okay? And join in later and have some more yoga later. Thank you everybody, happy Easter. See you soon everybody, miss you, take care. Mwah. Have a lovely Easter. Bye everybody.